Good morning, guys. So we're going to keep preparing for this little ATL trip. I am about to go get a pedicure, and then we're going to go do a Target run. Um, you know you're going on a trip when you go get the mini, so I'm hyped for that. Like, I love the minis. They're just so cute. But yes, first pedicure, then Target trip to get the minis, and later on after i get off of my part-time job we are going to do my nails because they need to be done so bad i did them last time i did them about like i don't even know two almost three weeks ago so it's time to switch it up i really don't know what i want to do i think i might do almond chrome uh, because that just seems to be like a common theme um, with my outfits and everything is like chrome silver like you guys will see what I'm talking about when I lay out all my outfits and everything like that so definitely I'm thinking chrome almond French tip but without further ado let's go get this pedicure because you know your girl be on her feet 12 hours almost every single day and my feet be hollering y'all hollering so let's go guys we made it to target um let's see if people mind their business today people be all up in my face when i'm vlogging it's like insane i'd be like do you want to be a part of the video because you can but in the meantime subscribe um but yeah so we're at target now y'all my biggest problem in target is that i don't know how to stay focused i've been in here all of but two minutes i've already gotten distracted three times one by starbucks which i don't need because i'm only drinking water right now two by these super cute pants that i seen that i thought would look so cute on my crew neck and three i wanted to go to the electronic section to get a new game for my switch but y'all we gonna stay focused we're gonna stay focused okay mini must-haves so we're gonna get one of these mini natives coconut and vanilla a must-have and then let's see what else they have <gasps> no they don't have a mini she is bomb edge control y'all if you don't know about this edge control you need to get into it i love this edge control it's the only thing that holds my edges down so we're gonna get a mini one of these oh shit this is cute. This just happens to be sitting there. But okay, we're not going to get distracted. We're going to put it back. We're going to put it back. Oh, they have another mini native one. Let's smell this one. I've never smelled the cucumber and mint. That smells good. Damn. So a couple more things I need. We are going to get just this little travel toothbrush kit. Always need a new travel toothbrush, even though I have 50 million at home. We are also going to get a mini deodorant. I love Dove Powder Fresh. That's just my preference um, for traveling when I am at home. I use like an essentials like lavender deodorant. Dove is my preference for traveling. We're gonna get a little loofah. Let's do the green. The green is cute. And y'all, honestly, that's it. Like, I'm sitting here trying to come up with excuses as to, like, other things I need. But I literally have so much stuff from the last time I went on vacation. I was like, do I need a new little pouch or anything to carry all this in? I really don't. So, I really just need to get the hell out of here. So guys, we got some packages for the trip that just came in today. These two are from Amazon, and this is, I'm pretty sure, from Shein. Um, so we're going to, like, unpackage them and just see what we got. And um, I'm just going to, like, show you guys. So starting with Amazon, half of these things don't even have to do with um, the trip. 
but I did for work get these cute colored headbands just for like um, my mask and everything like that. That's what this little button is for. So these are for work. Um, I just want to add some color to my uniform because my uniform is so boring. So that's what that's for. I re-upped on these Borg Life um, suppositories. They're Boric Acid. I absolutely love these. I feel like I've bragged about these on my channel before. I think before I was going on vacation, I mentioned them. Guys, y'all need these. Like, I just like to use these every once in a while, like just as a flush out for my girl down there. And they just do wonders. Like, they're amazing. Um, I've heard a couple people use them, like if they have yeast infections or if they've had bb and this just works wonders so you guys should definitely check this out so then there's this case and y'all i promise i didn't order this for the trip like i really just was on amazon and i saw it and i wanted it but it does happen to match a few of my outfits this is such a cute case i just love it so much it's like a foily chrome case and it just like i said happens to match a couple of my outfits and then the final thing from Amazon are these vacuum storage bags. I decided to get these because I'm flying spirit and I'm not trying to pay for a bag. I'm trying to use this small bag that I have. Um, and I don't know how I'm going to fit all my stuff, but someone recommended to me using these vacuum storage bags. So I'm going to try it out. These were literally $15 on Amazon. And these are the different sizes it comes with. It comes with like jumbo, extra large. No, it comes with jumbo large what's before large medium and small so we're gonna see if these really work oh and it comes with a little pump that um you need to take the air out i didn't think it came with one i thought you just had to use a vacuum but when we pack our stuff y'all we are definitely going to see if these work i'm praying because i do not want to pay for a bag i just not that i can't pay for a bag i just don't want to pay for a bag we cut in corners y'all all 2023 budgeting bitch you know what I mean? And then all this stuff from Shein is basically just like extra stuff that I needed for the trip. It's a lot of casual stuff because I ordered most of like my going out outfits a while ago. So this was just tying up loose ends. Like I think this is the jumpsuit that I had ordered for like a casual fit. This is a bodysuit for brunch. These earrings, I just need some cheap earrings for my second hole. So I got these needed some socks like some crew socks these were only like two dollars and you get white um black and gray um so i got those belly piercing mine broke and it's super ghetto there's just a piece of metal like in my belly button right now there's just like this piece of metal not even the ball nothing is on it so i did get a new piercing i never tried the dangles before super worried about that because if it gets caught i'm screwed but we're gonna see i like it this is another little jumpsuit bodysuit whatever you want to call it for another casual day out in the town this is a vest i'm trying to be like one of those cute daddies or whatever so it's like a cropped um vest i can't wait to put that fit together with the jumpsuit and then this is i actually don't know what this is what is this? We're gonna see what this is. Guys, I actually forgot that I ordered this. This is just a mesh, like kind of like turtleneck, sleeveless, black bodysuit. Um, I ordered this from one of my like little lounge fits. It's super cute how I'm gonna pair everything together with these really cute like purple cargo pants that I got. So yeah, that's basically everything I got from Shein. Okay guys, so we are in the packing phase now. And I took out two of the bags that I showed you guys. They are pretty big, as you guys can see. Um, this is what they look like. And then you have this like little thing right here where you attach either the pump that it came with or your vacuum to seal out the extra air and stuff. So I can't really tell if this size is a medium, a large, or whatever size it is. But I'm going to try one of these and see how many of my clothes I can get in here. If I could just do like all of my clothes in here and suck out all this air, that'd be great. Um, let me show you guys the bag that I'm going to bring. So guys, this is the tote that we are working with. I got this as a gift and I'm hoping it fits in here. I know everything I have won't fit in here. So what my friend and I are doing, we are actually bringing our first free bag which is like the size of this our backpack because spirit is so 
strict on their bags and then what we're doing is splitting the cost of the suitcase because we notice like our accessories like i have a lot of thigh high boots i have a lot of purses our accessories are the main things that will not fit so in this bag i'm going to try and deflate one of those bags to put my clothes in and then like my toiletries and that's it and then in the suitcase i'm splitting with my friend i'm going to try and put my boots and my accessories because I have a ton of thigh highs for my outfits not a ton more like one or two but like my shoes I just know will not fit okay guys so I kind of just like laid out my outfits and everything just to have an idea of how much stuff it actually is because I'm going to try and fit it all in one bag so we're going to try and do that now I broke the fucking, are you kidding me? Okay, so I'm lying. This actually slides back on. I thought I broke it, but this is everything. I may honestly have to take it out and like put it in meter, but we're gonna try and suction this out. So I'm gonna go grab my vacuum, try and suction it out and show you guys the final result and everything. But this is literally everything. If I was taking this in a suitcase, like for a longer trip, like this would be perfect, but I'm just worried about how it's gonna fit in that little tote, but we'll see. Y'all pause. Look at this. I put it back in a little bit more neat, but oh my gosh, all of those clothes sucked in. These are amazing. Why have I never used these before? All of my clothes. That is crazy. Let's try and put it in my tote. And wow, I'm just like, I'm just so amazed. That is crazy, y'all. Let's try and put it in my bag. Okay, guys, so I did do one thing. I just switched it into one of the, like, smaller, like, medium-sized bags because the jumbo one was sticking out the top of my bag. And this, I feel like, will definitely um, fit better. And I'll actually be able to zip up my bag now, which I didn't like that the other one was sticking out so much. But it does fit. I can actually take it out and show you guys. So this is what it looks like. And I did take my vest out because I realized I'm not going to be, like I don't have a jacket to wear the day of when I'm in the airport. I have like a long sleeve, like hoodie, like half crop top type thing. And I actually wanna wear my vest over it. So this is all the clothes. Like I pushed them all down. They were in there a lot neater, but I kind of just like shoved them in there. So that's what it looks like guys. Just all packaged in and I'm so glad it fits in my tote. So now I'm stress free about traveling and trying to fit everything in here. Totally recommend that you guys get these off of Amazon if you're gonna be traveling or anything like that. We gotta play the airlines y'all because they be trying to charge us. Like we didn't already pay $100 for a ticket. So I'm gonna link these down below in my bio and you guys should totally go check them out. All right guys, so it is now a nail day. I'm not gonna lie, I already started my nails and I low key forgot to start filming, but I just did a little refill um, using the nude that I had previously had on my nails. And sorry, the lighting is like terrible, but I just like basically refilled the nude that I had on my nails. And now I'm just filing down and reshaping. And I just decided like, I'm gonna keep it simple. And I think I'm just gonna do some chrome French tips. And that's it, like, because I really don't feel like looking for inspiration and all the inspiration I like, I forgot to order the supplies for it, like the little charms and stuff like that. And it's just, giving like i'm so tired from work and it's just giving something do something really simple and be done so let's speed this along because your girl is tired i have to work another 12 hour shift tomorrow and i'm ready to get in the bed so let's go So, so, so. 
So we are on day, I don't know what, of this prep for this ATL Girls Weekend birthday celebration slash reunion. Whatever you want to call it, y'all, I am so tired. I just got off of a 12-hour shift. For those of you that don't know, I am an ICU nurse. I work in a PICU, um, pediatric intensive care unit. Y'all, I'm so tired. I am running on, yesterday I had to also prep by taking out my weave. So I'm running on three hours of sleep. I slept three hours before my 12-hour shift last night. I'm so tired. But caught the train, raced home. So here I am now about to go into this hair appointment. I am super excited though because I'm trying a new hairstyle that I've never tried before. One of my goals for 2023 was to step outside my comfort zone and try new hairstyles and everything like that. So I'm doing like a half up, half down like pigtail hairstyle. So hopefully it looks cute on me. I don't know how it's going to look because... I don't know I'm just scared I'm just I'm really scared but I feel like it's like the perfect like cute girly vibe for this little girls weekend trip so let's go ahead in and see how it comes out also I didn't even have a chance to show you all my nails because my camera had died when I was doing them this is how they came out I'm not a fan of them I don't really like them I just think the chrome looks chunky and clunky it's probably because it's like a cheap chrome that I got off of Amazon but it looks decent enough so we just want to stick beside it. Here's the finished product. I am so obsessed. I'm so happy I chose this hairstyle, y'all. Like, I'm in love. Like, I'm actually in love. I feel like a freaking rat style. She definitely did her thing. I'm going to list her Instagram down below. So, if you're local to the area, you definitely have to go and support her because this was her first time doing the style. And I freaking love the way it came out. And it definitely had more curls, y'all, but it's raining outside. And I was like running to the car, so some of the curls dropped. But y'all have to get with her. I'm so, I'm so upset. All right, guys, this is where I'm going to end this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Your girl's about to go pack her stuff and catch this flight. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, leave a comment down below, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. We are on the road to 3K. I want each and every single one of you there for that journey. For all my subscribers already, I love each and every one of you and appreciate you so, so much. And I hope to see you in my next video, which will obviously be the ACL vlog. Bye.